Sagittarius. Hello, Sagittarius. This is Felicia from Jesus Take the Wheel, Tarot 1111, Sagittarius. So before I get started, what, remember Sagittarius, Tarot is all about energy. What I read for you guys today can be your past, present, or future situation, but I'm mainly focused on your present situation and what is to come, Sagittarius. Uh, one more thing. Cross watcher. This could be cross watcher energy as well because they do cross watch on you guys, and I can be picking up on their energy instead. So, yeah. All right, Sagittarius. First card out is love is going to find you. Stop looking. You, you're only bringing karmics towards you at this time. So, Sagittarius, you guys need to stop looking for love because you are only bringing karmic people, and we don't want karmics, right? We don't want karmics. We want healthy people in our life. Drugs, alcohol, rehab, body. So somebody could have some type of drugs. You, Sagittarius or Cross Watcher, um, could have some type of drinking, alcoholism, uh, drugs, or body issues. So when I say body issues, I mean like body dysmorphia. They could always focus on their body. They could always think like... You know, their body's not good enough and they're always doing something different to their body and they need to just stop because it's unhealthy, okay? And they need to get some type of help for that. You or cross watcher, Sagittarius. Woo, I'm going to take all that. All right, Sagittarius, pop-up visit. Someone wants to uh, pop up on you guys, surprise, do a sur surprise visit reach out in person. So yeah, somebody really wants to do that. We'll sleep with your man or woman. Ugh, always that. I'm so tired of third party situations. Uh, those church godly people in your family are the ones that stir the pot, Sagittarius. So those people who go to church and they act like, well, let's get to this one. Hold on. Sagittarius or cross watcher, somebody wants to sleep with your man or woman. Somebody is, I feel like somebody's, uh, there's always a third party in every single reading. Just third party, third party. I'm so tired of it. God don't bless no mess. You people stop sleeping around with other people's people. All right. <laughs> anyway. Those church slash godly people in your family are the ones that stir the pot the most. Okay. So... You guys may go vent to these people. These people may come to you and ask how you're doing. And next thing you know, you vent to them. You tell them all the bad stuff that's happening in your life. But you also tell them the good. And they only go back and talk about the bad stuff. And they mix it up and stir it up. And create chaos and drama in your life. Uh, those are the church godly people in your family. God said, pray to him, talk to him, get close to him. Then he will give you the answer. So you guys at this time, you could be... Um, confused and not really, you know, talking to God at this time and you forget he's always there for you. So you guys definitely need to talk to God. Okay. So pray, pray to God, talk to him. You know, he can th hear your thoughts. So you don't want to talk out loud, pray out loud. You can talk to him that way as well. Your spouse wants you to show him or her you are happy to be with them. The time is now. So Sagittarius, you could be uh, doing other things at this time that could set you back in your relationship and your spouse wants you to show him or her that you're happy to be with them. Okay, the time is now. You need to show your spouse some love. Ooh, I keep getting a lot for you guys. All right, we have a flyer. Give me one second here. All right, sat, ooh, caught sex offender, not yet caught. Okay, Sagittarius, there could be a sex offender in your life or cross watcher. Yes, yeah, sorry, Sag, I have to say it, or cross watcher. Um, a, sex offend, a sex offender who hasn't been caught yet or they have been caught yet, okay? This is your sign to say goodbye, people, place, or thing, Sagittarius. So you know what that means to you. It's time to say goodbye to people, place, or thing. Um, you know you're fed up when you're fed up. You know you have overthink it. You constantly think about it. Should I? What's going to happen if I do? And all that stuff. 
Close, co close contacts will never commit to you. They'll use you for a car or a place to live or money. Okay, so you have someone that you need to say goodbye to and this person will never commit to you. Uh, this person could be a sex offender. Oh, well, this card, she's pissed off, but I'm going to take this too because they want me to tell you this. Keep your faith. Okay, there's a lot of bad before the good. It's coming, do not give up. So you guys need to keep your faith at this time. And you have a woman that is pissed off. Someone is blocking your ninth house. That's travel, wisdom, higher education, law, religion, and learning ethics, okay? So someone is doing magic on you, blocking your ninth house. They don't want you to learn. They don't want you to grow. They don't want you to heal. They don't want you into spirituality. They don't want none of that. Yeah, you. we have pop-up visit twice. So pop-up visit, pop-up visit. Somebody is definitely going to do a pop-up visit. After I go through these cards, we'll go grab another deck and clarify, figure out who it is. What goes around comes around. So Sagittarius, if you've been feeling like you're just so tired of the bullshit, the drama, and all the crap that people put you through, don't worry about it because what comes around goes around. And hopefully, Sag, you're on the good side of that, not the wrong side because that's coming back around for you. Family is gaslighting you, okay? So there is family members that are gaslighting you. We have Virgo Energy Deacon 2, September 4th to September 13th. So this could be a family member of your Sagittarius who is gaslighting you. Or uh, Sagittarius, you could be gaslighting a Virgo. She is loyal. So Sagittarius, I'm getting that. Uh, someone in the family is saying that whoever is with someone, they're gaslighting this person and they're saying that there's a person that is she. We have a she's pissed out here behind this card as well. She's pissed off. So there could be someone in the family that's saying that she is not loyal, but she is loyal and this family member is gaslighting you. We have Taurus Energy, Deacon 2, April 30th to May 10th. Could be dealing with a Taurus within that birthday, uh, a Deacon Taurus, Deacon 2 Taurus, or you could be just dealing with a Taurus, but that's confirmation for you guys. If you're wondering um, if it's your Taurus, then these are the birth dates right here. Mad at you for speaking the truth. So there's somebody mad. A Taurus could be mad at you for speaking the truth. We have looks fade away. So Sagittarius, cross watcher, looks fade away. Keep that in mind. Karma is being mirrored back to them. So karma is being mirrored back to a person that maybe they were all about the looks. We do have drugs, alcohol, rehab, and body here. So we um, have someone who's all about their body, all about their looks. Um, karma is be being mirrored back to that person. Self-control, you got this. So... Um, Sagittarius, you need self-control. Your angels and spirit team are saying that you got this. Yes, you can do this. Yes, you can. So keep going. Staying with you because of kids. So, and Taurus Deacon 1, April 20th to April, or to April 29th. So 20th to the 29th, Deacon 1, Taurus. So you could be dealing, Sagittarius, with a Taurus um, and this person is staying with you because of the kids or you're staying with them for the kids wants you struggling so they can pick you up yeah so somebody wants you to struggle so they can pick you up so so sometimes in those situations um, people feel as though that like if they sabotage, because we have secretly reaching out to coworkers, if they sabotage your career, then you would be struggling, right? And then now they can pick you up. So someone is secretly reaching out to you. Ooh. Someone is re uh, secretly, sorry guys, secretly reaching out to your 
co-workers and hoping to get you fired so that they can uh, pick you back up again. And that is Taurus energy. Wanting to surprise you with a gift. So someone wants to surprise you with a gift. Now, this could be a good gift. This could be a bad gift. Cancer Deacon 1 wants to surprise you guys with a gift. Could be a cancer. June 21st to July 1st. Your friend is sad and trying to steal your life. So you guys have some friend out here that is sad trying to steal your life. I think... Aries had that too. So you could be dealing with an Aries Sagittarius as well. You need to release that person making you sad. Watch. Watch what happens when you do. So you need to release that person that's making you sad and watch what's going to happen when you do. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, Deacon 2, January 30th to February 8th. Could be, don't have to be, could just be an Aquarius. This person is all about the money, though, so maybe you do need to release them. It's time to release that Aqua because they are all about the money. Or Crosswatcher, this could be for you. Block solar plex chakra. So at this time, you guys could have a um, lack in self-confidence. You can have low self-esteem. Lack of worth, inability to digest your food, lack of energy. So someone is blocking your solar plex chakra. Let's see who's blocking your solar plex chakra. We have Aquarius energy, definitely Aquarius, and I just said Aquarius, okay? So who else? A Leo. So a Leo and Aquarius could be blocking your solar plex chakra, Sagittarius. Family is trying to split you up. So you guys could have... Um, family members that are trying to split you guys up at this time, you'll know if your family, well, maybe not hidden secrets that will harm you. Yeah, you guys don't know that your family's trying to split you up secretly. Um, these people are spreading lies and they're saying things. So, so your family is trying to split you up. Sagittarius or cross watcher and they're going to your spouse and they're saying that you know you're doing something that would make it so that that person splits up with you um criminal wants you to feel safe around them again so someone could have went to jail and this person is a criminal and they want you guys to feel safe around them again they want to earn your trust back could be a taurus deacon three may 11th to may 20th Family member, family member who works in healthcare is in your record, Sagittari Sagittarius. So, or cross watcher and Capricorn energy, Deacon 3, January 11th to the 20th. So you guys could have a family member that is, works in healthcare that could be looking into your records for some reason. So if you know that you guys have a family member who's doing that and uh, maybe you don't want, whoa, you know what I just heard? I just heard this. You guys have a family member trying to split you up and they're looking into your healthcare records or your spouse's healthcare records and they know secrets that will harm you. So, so if your person went to, let's say, for example, if you, there were rumors that your person got some type of STD, then you have a family member that works in healthcare and they're looking into this person's records and you're not, like maybe you don't know that. This person could be a drunk as well. We also have drugs, alcohol rehab out here, so you could be dealing with a drunk. Um, but this person is looking into this, your spouse's record, healthcare records, and they're making, they could, they could look into certain things and they could be, you know, telling your spouse this about you or Sagittarius. This is happening to you with a cross watcher. So you guys need to be mindful of that. This person could be a drunk or you could be a drunk in some love hate relationship. More Aquarius energy could be dealing with an Aquarius Sagittarius. She is unhealed. So you guys have someone that is unhealed out here. So 
if you know a person is unhealed and you know that you know you've tried to help them then it is time to say goodbye that person place or thing this person could be doing root chakra on you guys okay all right sorry guys my son's leaving all right so this person could be doing root chakra work on you guys but so she is unhealed and maybe some root chakra is being done on her and it'll be worth the wait it'll be worth the wait if you wait for this person because she needs to heal so we have pisces deacon one february 19th to february 29th and libra deacon two october 3rd to the 12th now keep in mind uh this could be just a libra and this could be just a pisces we have sexual addiction so someone has a sexual addiction out here yes she is wrong so maybe you had a she out here that she is unhealed and she has a sexual addiction don't beat yourself up for it though okay don't spirit says don't beat yourself up for it this won't last long yeah you guys might think that this won't last long with this person because she's unhealed We have just go with the flow. So do you guys just need to go with the flow at this time? Yes, he really loves you. So maybe she thinks that because she's unhealed, she has some trauma in her life. And she is accusing you of, you know, cheating or not loving. And maybe there's some type of sex addiction. Maybe she's accusing you of some type of sex addiction. But yes, he really loves you. Ask God to go, ask God to show you, not people. So yeah, so this person or you, Sagittarius, ah, she's triggered. Yes, she's triggered. You have a she out here. She's unhealed, could be a drunk. She's triggered, always accusing you of something.